You know, sickle cell disease has been a very, very difficult disease to manage, um, and there aren't a lot of great therapies for this problem. One of the mainstays of therapy has been a drug called hydroxyurea, and it's basically used to increase the levels of fetal hemoglobin to help prevent sickling. Well, hydroxyurea has its own problems. It can lower the blood counts. It can cause other issues. There's a drug called pomalidomide, which is actually a mainstay of therapy for multiple myeloma. Actually been FDA approved for myeloma treatment within the past year. And it turns out that this drug, which is used for an entirely different disease, actually increases the levels of hemoglobin F. And there was actually a phase one study looking at this in patients with sickle cell. Uh, and it's able to increase the levels of hemoglobin F without some of the toxicities they had with hydroxyurea. So although further study is needed, we may be on to a new way of treating patients with that awful disease.